guys, today in the shop I'm working on a small jig. This jig is going to be used to make some very small wedges. I contemplated the idea of making a jig uh, either to use on a table saw or on the planer, but really what it came down to is I didn't feel very safe um, doing that and you know this is just a lot more enjoyable. So this works out great, very simple. I'm going to show you some of the details on it, how I use it and show you how these wedges are used for the piece of furniture I'm working on right now. So I already have my blank milled uh, to the size that it needs to be. I actually already have my front stop set so just put this guy in here. Slide the next stop to it and then lock it down. Try to pinch it as tight as you can. Now my block plane is already set so everything's you know been set. I've already done the test pieces so I know this is going to work for what I need. Probably a little shaky, the bench moving around. But there it is. You know, it's important to put a square across it, make sure it's parallel and things look pretty good. You, sh you should be able to just look at it by eye and tell. But real simple, it's even hard to tell by the eye that it's wedged, but it's perfect for what I need right now. The, the jig's kind of made uh, as a multi functional jig. So, as you can see, uh, right here there's some little 8 inch uh, wedges that were made up for this given project but if I want to switch it out and change it I can simply, these are just double stick taped in I can peel those out, make some new ones uh, with a different angle ratio or even if I wanted to have it I don't know, say I had some half inch stuck or 3 8 inch stuck that I wanted to play in some small little dividers or whatever uh, you could have just a straight one in here too and it will do that. So, you know, you're limited obviously on the, the width of the piece but this jig I've already used on several di uh, different things um, and it doesn't take up much room, just put it, you know, hang it on the wall and use it next time. 